When the captain on the Straw Hat Pirate squares up against a government assassin built like a tank, you know things are about to go down. Luffy's here to save his crewmate, Robin, and Luchi's here to crush anyone who stands in his way. It's about to get wild. The scene is set aboard the giant ship in its lobby, where Luffy and Rob Luchi, the strongest agent of CP9, are about to clash in an epic showdown. Nico Robin, Luffy's crewmate, has been captured by the world government, and she's moments away from being taken for good, but Luffy isn't about any of them. He's come all the way here to save her, and there's nothing, especially not Luigi, standing in his way. For Luffy, this fight isn't just about winning, it's about saving Robin, someone he considers family. Luigi, however, is a cold-blooded killer who sees Luffy as nothing more than an obstacle. It's heart versus sheer brute strength, and only one is walking away victorious. How did a carefree pirate end up fighting a government assassin who's all business? Luffy's fighting for his crew, while Luchi's all about enforcing justice with his fist. Luffy, the rubbery captain on the Straw Hats, is all about protecting his friends. When Robin was captured by the world government, Luffy didn't hesitate to chase after her, no matter how dangerous it was. He's always been driven by loyalty and he'll do whatever it takes to bring Robin back, even if it means facing one of the strongest opponents he's ever met. Rob Lucci is a CP9 assassin with a reputation for being unstoppable. His Zorn type devil fruit gives him the ability to transform into a lever, and his fighting style is all about overwhelming upon his enemies with steer power. Lucci sees Luffy's determination as foolish. He's been trained to eliminate threats, and he doesn't see Luffy as anything more than another target. As Luffy and Lucci step up for a fight, the tension's higher than Sky Island. Will Luffy's determination to save Robin be enough to take down the assassin, or is Luchi about to crush the Straw Hat Captain's hopes? Luffy stands tall, his Straw Hat shadow in his determined eyes. He's not just fighting for himself, he's fighting for Robin, someone who once thought she wasn't worth saving. Luffy's the kind of guy who will never back down when his friends are on the line. And this battle is about showing Robin that she's part of the crew, no matter what the world says. The pressure's on, and the rest of the Straw Hats are counting on Luffy to win. He knows that if he can't beat Luchi, Robin's gone for good, and that's something he won't let happen. On the other hand, Luchi's as cold and calculated as ever. He's a government assassin, trained to follow orders without emotion. To him, this fight is just another mission. He doesn't care about Luffy's bond with his crew. He's here to make sure the world government will is enforced. And if that means taking out Luffy, and so be it. When Luffy's rubbery fists meet Luchi's deadly claws, you know it's about to get serious. It's a battle of heart versus brute force. Let's see who's got what it takes to stand tall. The fight kicks off with Luffy charging in. The fight kicks off with Luffy charging in, fists flying and energy surging. Luffy knows, known for his wild and unpredictable fighting style, and he's bringing everything he's got to the table, but Luchi is cool and composed, using his enhanced strength and speed to counter Luffy's attacks effortlessly. He's not just strong, he's calculated, dodging Luffy's blows and hitting back with devastating power. As the fight rages on, it becomes clear that Luchi's not just any opponent. He's faster, stronger, and his real sticky techniques are almost impossible to counter. Every time Luffy tries to land a hit, Luchi's already moving out of the way or delivering a counterattack that sends Luffy flying. But Luffy's not one to give up easily. He keeps getting back up, even as the blows keep coming. Luffy's not just fighting for himself, he's fighting for Robin. And that thought keeps him going, no matter how tough things get. Luchi, on the other hand, is showing no mercy. He transforms into his hybrid leopard form making him even more dangerous. His claws are sharp, his speed is terrifying, and every punch he lands feels like it could break Luffy in half. Luchi isn't just fighting to win, he's fighting to crush Luffy completely, leaving no room for hope. The battle is brutal, with both fighters giving it their all, but Luchi's overwhelming strength starts to wear Luffy down, 
and it looks like the fight might be slipping out of Luffy's hands. As Luchi turns up the heat, Luffy's on the ropes, but with Robin's freedom on the line, Luffy's not about to give up. Can Luffy dig deep enough to pull out the win, or is Luchi too strong to beat? Just when things look hopeless, Luffy digs deep and pulls out a new technique. Here, second. His body starts steaming as he increases the blood flow through his veins, boosting his speed and power to a whole new level. The tables start to turn as Luffy, moving faster than Luchi can react, lands a flurry of powerful blows. The crowd watches in awe as Luffy's attacks gain momentum. And for the first time, Luchi looks surprised. Luffy's not just some reckless kid, he's a force to be reckoned with. And his newfound power is proving it. But Luchi's not out yet. He steps up his game, unleashing even more brutal attacks, including his powerful real Kogan technique. Luffy takes heavy hits, but even as he gets knocked down again and again, he refuses to give up. Every time Luchi thinks he's got Luffy beaten, Luffy rises to his feet, bloody but still determined. It's hard versus strength, and the tension is higher than ever. With both fighters at their limit, it's time for the final blow. Can Luffy pull off one last attack to save Robin, or is Luchi about to crush his dream of freedom? With both fighters exhausted and the battlefield in ruins, Luffy decides it's time to end this once and for all. He taps into gear third, inflating his arm to a gigantic proportions and channeling all his energy into one final massive punch thumbnail gigant pistol this punch is so powerful it shakes the entire ship luchi tries to block it but the force of luffy's attack is too much the punch lands sending luchi crashing through the walls and into the sea the fight is over and luffy stands victorious barely able to stay on his feet as luchi falls the silence is deafening the once invincible CP9 agent has been defeated, and Luffy, against all odds, has won. But Luffy's not celebrating yet. He knows there's still one thing left to do, save Robin. The battle was won, but Luffy's fight isn't over. With Luchi defeated, it's time for Luffy to do what he came for, save Robin. And show the world what it means to be a straw hat. Luffy's victory isn't just about beating Luchi, it's about proving that when it comes to his crew, nothing can stop him. He's pushed himself to the brink, fought with everything he had, and came out on top. Now with Luchi out of the way, Luffy is finally able to reach Robin and tell her the one thing she needed to hear. You're coming with us. With Luchi defeated and Robin free, the Straw Hats can finally escape in his lobby. But the battle has left its mark on everyone. Luffy, though victorious, knows that the fight for his crew will never be over, but that's what it means to be a pirate. He'll face any challenge, fight any battle, and go to any length to protect his friends. And with Robin's Robin back on the crew, the Straw Hats are stronger than ever. Make sure you hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. Thank you guys for checking out this video. Stay tuned for the next one. Sing me to Peace.